So, I went to Goodwill the other day, and I found this. It's one of those really cool vintage clocks, and I've actually been looking for one for quite a while. And I went to Goodwill, and I found one for only $5. And based on eBay, that's pretty good. So when I saw it, I knew I had to get it. But it's a little dirty, and it's got some dust. So I'm gonna clean it. Now, it seems to have a hardwood finish, and it reminds me a lot of the Atari 2600. And I really like that a lot about it. But I don't think it's real wood. I think it's just painted on there or graphic on there. So, I don't know if I can clean this with the alcohol. So I'll have to look that up. So, it turns out that I can. Oh, and by the way, it does work when I plug it in. And so does the radio. Really? There we go. Well, it's getting somewhere. But the dust is really thick. So we're about halfway done with the top. So it's not perfect, but it is a lot better. And it was paint, and some of it did come off with the alcohol. So that's a lesson to learn. And I just realized that my light wasn't turned all the way up. So, see if there's a difference. Oh yeah. That's better. So, overall, it looks pretty good now compared to what it was. The top still got quite a bit of dust that I wasn't able to get out of there, but at least there's not a bunch of dust on it. The scream seems fine. Oh, 
Gotta get that sticker off here. when they put stickers on stuff because it leaves a residue. Ah. So I don't really see anything else I can do to it now, but I'm kind of upset that the alcohol took the paint off, but I guess I learned not to do use that with stuff like this, but it got the dust off for the most part. But in good spirits, now at least I get to listen to the horrid, horrid sound that these clocks make whenever the alarm goes off. Yay. <sighs> oh, and I have a package coming. And it's about four pounds, six ounces. So try to guess what it is. And I'll make a video of it when it gets here. If you think that I did a good job and would like to see more, please like and subscribe. And if you have any tips or tricks on cleaning for the future or any products like that, please comment them down below. Those would definitely be helpful. And thank you for watching.